Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina left the country for U.S. to attend the U.N. General Assembly. Today is the 10th of Muharram. Holy Ashura is being observed in the country. And digital security will be no obstacles in independent journalism, said Obaidul Qadir. Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to My TV News. I'm Fozer Roshan Akhtar with you in the newsroom today. We are still watching the headlines. Now the details. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina left the country for London on Friday morning and rode to New York on a week-long official visit to the United States to attend the 73rd session of the United Nations General Assembly. A VVIP flight of Biman Bangladesh Airlines carrying the Premier took off from Hazrat Shahzalal International Airport for London at 10.20 a.m. The flight is scheduled to arrive at Hadro Airport in London at 3.55 p.m. local time today. The Prime Minister will address the 73rd session of the UN General Assembly at the UN headquarters in New York in the evening on September 27 and hold a meeting with UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres on the same day. Today is the 10th day of the month of Muharram in the Arabic calendar. Muslims across the world recall the sacrifice of Hazrat Imam Hussain along with his 72 followers who embraced martyrdom in 680 AD for establishing truth and justice in the fight with the soldiers of Yazid on Karbala Maidan in Iraq. Different political, socio-cultural and religious organizations have chucked out various programs to observe the day in a befitting manner with the Tazia Mitchell starts from capitals Hosni Dalan. The day is a public holiday. Regarding the book written by former Chief Justice S. K. Sinha, Road Transport Minister Badul Khada said that he could have made the book another time. He also said this has provoked the opponents of the government, the propagators. The minister made such remarks when talking to journalists after visiting the Dhaka Tangal Dhaka Mamasing Highway. Development work in Gajipur. Obaidul Khader also said that the Digital Security Act has been enforced to prevent a digital crime. There is no reason to worry, anxiety or panic. The minister expressed hope that there will be no obstacles in independent journalism and independent opinion. BNP Secretary General Mirza Fakhrul Islam Alamgir has alleged that the government is launching arrest warrant against BNP activists to push the election into a path of uncertainty. He complained at the press conference of BNP chairperson's office in Gulshan in the morning. Mirza Fakhrul also complained that instead of a democracy, the government is establishing one party rule in the country. Alamgir also said that Khalid Zia ought to be freed from the movement. The BNP General Secretary said that people will judge one day for government's violation of constitution. Three people were killed and 15 others injured in a road accident on Dhaka Rajshai Highway at Tara Pukur in Putia Bazila on Thursday night. The accident took place around 11.30 p.m. when a Dhaka-bound Shamoli Poribahan bus rammed a sudden laden stationary track on the road, leaving three people dead on the spot and 15 others injured, said Putia police. The injured were taken to Putia Bazila Health Complex. Among the injured, the condition of five victims was stated to be critical, said police. On information, police recovered the bodies and sent those to hospital morgue for autopsy. Two members of UPDF were shot dead by a group of unidentified criminals in Rangamati's Narnia Churupazila early today. OC of Narnia Chirpur's station said that UPDF members were sleeping in a house at Ram Suparipara village under Shabe Kong at night. A group of armed men opened fire on the house during the wee hours, leaving them dead on the spot. On information, police rushed to the spot and recovered the bodies from the spot. 
viewers that's all from our newsroom for now thanks for being with us to join with my tv news online visit www.youtube.com slash my tv bd news and to watch all your programs on youtube visit youtube.com slash my tv bangla our next bulletin will be telecast in bangla at 7 30 pm don't forget to join with us till then stay connected allah hafiz